step Step number one, find determinant first Remember, kalau nak cari inverse Always start with determinant So, determinant of P is what? How to find determinant of 2 by 2? You cross multiply lah, betul lah? So, 1 times 4, 4 minus 6 lah So, your answer is what? Negative 2 So, determinant, first step, determinant Second step is you find actually minor, tapi in 2 by 2, there's no minor <coughs> No need to find both factor, straight away go to adjoin Father, 2 by 2 ni, determine Then, adjoin straight away, dia minor, both factor semua, step tinggal 3 by 3 ni, got all the 5 steps So, step number 2, find adjoin How to find adjoin? I say what? Change, change place, change sign, is it So, your answer will be 4, 1, negative 2, negative 2 Tadi dah belajar just show a repeat again Then step number 3 straight away you find inverse So how to find inverse? There's a formula Inverse P thunder P dash Equals to 1 over This one means what? Square This one is what? This symbol Two lines Two lines means determinant Hello you see determinant and dual line uh, P that is find determinant P In other words The formula of inverse is 1 over determinant times a joint. That's why you must find a joint. You must find determinant. So from here, the remember the determinant is negative 2, 3? Negative 2, eh? Times a joint you get from here. This one is good here. Then after that, you take 1 over negative 2 means negative half. Lah. Negative half times 4, your answer is what? Negative half times 4, you get negative 2 Negative half times negative 2 Negative negative, positive 2 and 2 cancel, you get 1 Then negative half times negative 3, you get 3 over 2 Then, positive Negative half times 1, you get negative half That's the inverse of matrix P Okay? Any questions? Okay, next. Uh, for matrix 3 by 3, there are 5 steps. Panjang sikit lah sebab dia kena cari minor. You have to find the uh, cofactor. You have to find a joint. Then you have to find inverse. Of course, first step always start with determining the 5 steps. No? Okay? So for 3 by 3, for this matrix Q, first step, find the determinant. How to find determinant? I told you, take this matrix, copy, then the first two column, copy N. Then you cross multiply, and then see what's the answer. So you should get the answer equals to 2. Tadi dah belajar Okay? I just repeat again. So the, the determinant of Q is... Two, eh? Step one, okay? Our objective is to find the inverse matrix, eh? Inverse, alright? So next step number two, you have to find minor. How to find minor? You have to do find one by one. A one one, A one two, A one three until A three one, A three two, A three three. Yes or no? Remember the step now, eh? So you find one by one. We already done just now. I just cut short. I put the answer here. Minor the cherry. Tadi, eh? Cara tadi. Then next step is to find the cofactor. How to find cofactor from minor? You take the minor times the positive negative positive. Remember lah. Eh? It times the sign. So this sign you get this answer. Okay? Then from cofactor, how to find a joint? Step number four. So a joint is a transposition of uh, the cofactor. Panda. Transposition of the cofactor to sign. So this one I get from previous one. Okay? Earlier I show you the method. Okay? But I want to show you step number five. No? How to find the inverse of Q? So same formula. Inverse of Q is 1 over determinant times a joint. Ah, standard formula. 2 by 2 by 3 by 2, 3 same. So we have 1 over Q. Determinant of Q, tadi dah cari, is uh, 2 just now. Alright? Times uh, the adjoint. This one. This adjoint. Eh? So from here, 
you get 1 over 2 times 6, you get 3. 1 over 2 times negative 15, you get negative 15 over 2. Neg uh, half times negative 2, you get negative 1. Half times 0, 0. Half times 1, half. Half times 0, you get 0. Half times negative 4, you get negative 2. Half times 11, you get 11 over 2. Half times 1, you get 1. Okay? So that is the inverse of matrix Q. Okay, any question?